Good morning and happy Team Thursday. It's Jen with Polk County Public Libraries and this week's Tales and Tales animal theme is Jungle Animals. So for our teen kit this week, we have uh, some supplies to make to do animal napkin folding. So in your take and make kit, you have two napkins. They're either a light brown like this or a light gray like this. You have three rubber bands and you have two googly eyes. So, full disclosure, this is one of my kind of fail kits of the summer. I thought last week was so cool with the owl pellets, and then this one is really hard for me. And also, the napkins are a little too thin uh, for what we're trying to do, but we are going to make it work. Um, originally, I had put that we were going to do an elephant, but an elephant was really hard, so we're going to do a monkey instead. Now. My monkey looks like Baby Yoda. So if you like Star Wars and the Mandalorian and you like Baby Yoda, you can make a little Baby Yoda. If not, maybe you can try to make yours look a little bit more like a monkey. Um, also, if you search online, you can find lots of videos to make other jungle animals. You can find the elephant video. Um, and also, if you have a linen closet at home with towels and washcloths, uh, you can try some different colors, different fabrics, and see what works best. Uh, but this is a great craft uh, to do at home when you're bored during the summer because you probably have the stuff you need for it lying around the house. All you need is towels or napkins and uh, sometimes little supplies like rubber bands. So uh, I'm going to change the video so you can see it up close and I'm going to show you how to make your monkey aka Baby Yoda. Okay we are ready to make our napkin monkey. So this napkin is a little bit wider than the video screen, but hopefully you can still follow along. So you're going to need one of your napkins and three rubber bands. And then the googly eyes are optional. We can put those on afterwards if we want. So as I said earlier, this is not my, my best technique. So let's see what we can do. All right, so you're gonna start with one end of the napkin and you're going to try to roll it up really tightly towards the middle. And these napkins are already kind of creased for you in that middle, so that helps know where you want to stop. All right, so I rolled that end to the middle, and these napkins are also square, so you, you can start at either end. The trick is holding this down so it stays tight while you roll the other side in. Hopefully this will work on the first try. It's been a lot of trial and error for me figuring this out. All right, so we've rolled each side of the napkin down to the middle. All right, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna start about, take about two thirds of the napkin here, and we're going to twist it over like this. All right, so we have the monkey's legs here monkey's arms here. And this is going to be the monkey's face. Okay, so we're going to take a rubber band and twist around just at the top of the arms. So the face might look huge to begin with. It's going to get a lot smaller because we're going to use those other two rubber bands for ears. So make it pretty tight and then you can go back in. This monkey has little short arms, little short legs. Like I said, he looks like Baby Yoda. This could also kind of be a person. It could be lots of different things. That's the great thing about napkin animals. They're very versatile. All right, so see the monkey's giant face? We're gonna make his face smaller by giving him ears. And you're gonna use the rubber band, for a rubber band for each ear. So there's my first ear. All right, I'm gonna scratch out Trying to make them pretty even. Man, this thing looks like Yoda. But kind of like a cute little monkey too. As I said, there are lots of videos on YouTube and online where you can learn to make elephants and all kinds of animals. But that is how you make your basic monkey Yoda person shape. Legs, arms, ears, head. Here's my other one. And, uh, if you make one and you're really happy with it and you want to keep it forever, you could glue some googly eyes on it. Makes it look even crazy.
easier, but I think it kind of makes it look a little bit more like a monkey when you have the googly eyes on there. So if you want to keep it, glue some googly eyes on it, and I hope you guys have fun with this activity. Thank <laughs> you.